Create a new presentation, delete these text boxes, then insert a rounded rectangle. Copy and paste, make it smaller than the first one. Copy and paste four of the small rectangles and place two above the big rectangle and two below. Space them equally. Select everything and group. Align the group to the middle. Change the color of the shapes to a color of your choice. Write something inside the rectangle to be able to differentiate them. In my case I wrote the letters A, B, C, D, E. For the big rectangle, make the text font larger. Right click, format background and choose gradient fill. Pick the colors you want. I'm just changing the color of the shapes to make sure they contrast with the background. Duplicate the shapes and drag them to the side. We are going to use them for measurements and alignments later on. Duplicate the slide and move the shapes like I'm doing. Now shape A on the right is aligned to shape B on the left. Move shape E out of the frame. Shrink shape C and enlarge shape B don't forget the font size. Copy the slides and move the shapes downwards again. Now shape A must be the large one, just follow what I'm doing. If you already get what I'm doing, you may skip a few minutes. Each big rectangle must be perfectly aligned with the shape C on the left part of the slide. We may delete these shapes, we no longer need them. You should be having something like this. Select slide 2 to 5, go to transitions and choose morph transition.
Look at what we have now. Wow. The transition is too slow for my liking, so let's decrease the duration. Now we're talking. Let's add a click sound. Add a text box. Write whatever title you want. I'm just gonna right select your avatar because this is kind of a character selection menu in a game. I'll change the font and increase font size. Change the color. Copy and paste on every slide. Time to insert our characters. You may insert 3D models, but my computer is too slow for that. Please donate for me to buy a better performing computer, a mic and stop using this stupid AI voice. My PayPal link is in the description. Thanks in advance. Add your characters on each slide. I'm just gonna decrease the brightness on this one. He is a locked character. Unlock him at level 1000. Copy and paste on the previous slide and move to the left of the frame. Do this for all your avatars, characters, whatever you want to call them. Now copy and paste in the following slide and move to the right of the frame. Shrink them. Okay, but they are moving in front of the rectangles. Let's fix that real quick. Just select the characters and send them to the back. It's time to name your characters. I like this one, let's call him Bart. Okay, yeah I got it from The Simpsons. For this one, we don't know him yet so let's insert a lock icon. I'm just gonna skip this part.
OK. Make every character out of the frame to be transparent. Make every big rectangle lighter in color. I'm inserting another text box. You don't have to do exactly what I'm doing. Just go wild with it and be creative. I'm just teaching you how to do it. We can leave it like this, but let me just try to be more creative. Select this text and add a color pulse animation to it. Change to start with previous. We want the animation to play until we move on to the next slide, so let's fix that real quick. It's going too fast so let's make it slower. I want to change the effect color to a light blue. Let's add a blink animation to this text. My PC is slowing down again, guys please donate, God will bless you, heavily. I think that's the end of the tutorial. You can download this template on Etsy for only $2. The link is in the description. This video took me about 8 hours to plan, transcribe the text, edit and render. So please like the video and subscribe. Thanks for watching. And please donate. Bye.